when we look at tradition, right, herbal traditions, they, they didn't have an understanding of plant chemistry, right? They didn't know that, they didn't know about sesquiterpene lactones and they didn't know about alkaloids and, you know, they didn't know about iridoid glycosides and all these different classes of compounds that we find in plants. Uh, so they didn't obviously think about that as being the way that the plants heal. They saw because they saw that the plants, they didn't view the body as like a machine. And it's very common that the more biomedical, biochemical model kind of views the human being like a machine. And in tradition, we see that the human body is really viewed more as an ecosystem, that the body is a mirror image of nature and that we get sick because of ecological imbalances within the body, that then the plants come in and restore that ecological imbalance, not necessarily through chemistry, but through the vital force, through the vital intelligence of the plant. And this always kind of brings up an interesting kind of, uh, I guess, polarity and ways of thinking about what herbal medicines do, which is, is the plant acting on the body or is the body responding to the plant?